What's going on YouTube? Jeans here bringing you guys part 6 for my playthrough on Super Mario 3D World for the Nintendo Switch. So guys, in the last episode we started World 5 and only completed half of it. And in today's video we're going to be fully completing it up, 100%ing it by collecting all the green stars and the stamps and getting to the top of the flagpoles. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. This world is actually decently big, probably the biggest one we've ever so far. And I can show you guys, um, oh wait, we just fast traveled to the world. And I just wanted to actually show you the list of it. There we go. We did 5, 1, 5, 2, 5, 3, 5, 4, 5, 8, and we did the Toad, uh, Captain Toad thing. So now we have four more levels, plus the boss fight, and a 5B little thing. And then we got to collect everything. But before we actually get started here, you guys already know the deal. We heading over. We getting our slots on. We getting our slots on. We're going to test our luck here. Last time we went 3 out of 4, and the time before that we went 4 for 4. Hopefully we can go 4 for 4 here and get our little Wendy steal going. <laughs> but... Hopefully we can get this uh, middle part here. I'd like to get double hits. Nope. All right. Looks like we're going for cat bells, baby. Let's go. Let's go, yo. I got this down to a science. Let's go. We got this down to a science. Come on, baby. Let's get this video started off strong. Ladies and gentlemen, I am the greatest slot player on planet Earth. Seriously. If you guys want, you can uh, send me your whole bank account, and I will just... Play slots and double your money back for you guys. So just send me your money. All right. Sounds good. Sounds good. Let's get it. <laughs> but there we go. Getting the video started off strong with a couple one ups. But we're going to head over to uh, 5 6. No, we'd rather do 5 5 first. We got bomb arms below. I feel like I remember this level. This one has like lights and bombs. And you got to throw the bombs at the wall. Pretty straightforward. But we get after We are Mario today. I switched to Mario. I do like using Mario. Look at this, you give me that bomb. And the best part about Mario is an easy thumbnail for jeans, considering I can help what's it called. There are a lot of Mario PNGs to actually use, <laughs> which is awesome. But we are going to get a Tanuki Tail. Like, I wanted to get a nice uh, PNG of, uh, of what's it called, of Tanuki Luigi, but I couldn't get one for the last episode, which is whack. And not like that at all. Uh, can I get up here? I can. There is a bomb there. I can actually, or there's a pal bot there. What's over here? I hear something in here. The green star. Go so chill on me. Chill on me, Koompas. I slap all you guys up. I should have just did like the, the, if you hold down this, you can just like do multiple spins. That's gonna be very good up against uh Goomba Towers. We got this thing, let's uh throw this bomb here. Pick up, dude. That was awful. Oh no, you kidding me? Alright, I guess we just gotta chase this one up <laughs> in order to get it. Come here, one up. Give me that thing, thank you very much. Okay, so we got one star down. Is this another green star? This is. Okay, what's up, buddy? You know, I feel like if I just chase you around this way, we'll be able to catch him. There we go. Because <laughs> the pass moving this way. It'll be a lot easier. So, we start number one and two. Now we need to stamp, and it looks like there's something in between this wall. So, I'm going to just get this bomb here. And I'm going to throw that at the wall. Can I break that wall? Yeah. Yeah, yo, Jeans knows what's up. An arrow this way. Can I just hit this pal block? I can. Beautiful. And there's stamp. Perfect. Okay, cool. That Tanuki Mario. I think he looks so sick. I like the, uh... The Tanuki Tail in Mario 3D Land for the 3DS. It's like the one that turns you into stone. I think that one's sick. Comes with a little scarf. Okay, and there's that. Um, there is a pipe that goes downwards, but I know I can just float this way. I guess that pipe, if you go downwards, it leads you there, but I'd rather just do the jump with the Tanuki Tail. Oh, we jamming. Alright, this foul block. Oh, we just gotta light all these up. Oh, nice. Give me all these. Give me all these. <laughs> the beep boop, beep boop. This, this sound reminds me of, uh, if you guys ever seen the Spongebob episode, it's like, uh, when Mr. Krabs is playing that song on his radio all day and they think he's a robot. Beep boop, beep boop. <laughs> that's a classic, that's a classic episode. Yo, chill me, bomb mom. Come here, we're almost done. We're almost done here. Light up these last ones. I'm gonna slap up on him. Get him out of here. I throw the bomb off the ledge. Can I pick up this bomb? Thank you. Get out of here. One more. Bang, there we go. Get ourselves third and final green, sir. Yes, sir. Give me that thing. Long jump. Yeah. And now we can just escape this way. I'll grab this timer and then heading down there. Yeah, I'm really liking this world. I am really liking this world. I think it's going to take the top tier list. So far, it's a lot of fun. Because considering there's some cool levels in it, and they're all different. They really are. They all have their like different little variety to it. Get rolling here. Oh, yo, dude. This pal box is dope. <laughs> just slapping on everybody. Come here, Koopa. Okay, now, and is that everything? Yeah, we got everything. We're just chilling here. Oh, there was a coin in the light. <laughs> you guys saw that. Oh, all right. So in order to get this, I could cat suit it, but I'm going to do this the right way. There's a bomb up there. Oh, that was a perfect throw. Makes us be able to get up here. Now I just use my tanuki tail. 
Yeah, we don't need no cat suit for this one. That last one in the last video, I think it was level two, was the circus one, where you had to use the uh, the pendulum swing to get on top of the flight pole. That was the hardest flight pole we had so far. I couldn't get that one without the cat suit. I tried it twice. You guys saw it. I didn't even come close. I hit like the 2,000 mark when then there's 4,000, 8,000, and then the top. So we were like middle of the flight pole. I couldn't even get close to it. I thought I was swinging perfectly. I thought I had everything good, but we were just failing. But 130 green stars already. I wonder how many green stars it is going to take to actually unlock the boss fight. Because I love seeing how many green stars we are ahead of it. But I'm actually going to head over here. Get us off this little circus thing. There is still a 5B. I gotta remember. And that might come after world like in the last one. The last one came after the boss fight. Oh, yo. Yo, our stamp collection is looking tough. You know what the stamp collection reminds me of? It reminds me of Disney. Like, I'm a big fan of Disney World in uh, Florida, and they have pins, and you can trade pins and all that with the workers, and they, like, have a collection. So, I think it's so much fun. It really makes Disney, like, an awesome trip for me because I get some pins, I trade them around with people, and I uh, collect them, which is so much fun. I collect they're called sets, where it's just, like, certain pins are in certain sets. And, yeah, I collect them all. But um, let me know in the comment section down below if you guys uh, ever do Disney pins. I think they're so much fun. They're absolute blast. We got, what is this place called? I want to know the name. Take walk foot. Oh, I can actually drop down on here. Be cool. Is there anything down here? But yeah, I would love to know if any any people any people who watch Gene's YouTube uh, do some pin training because I'm a big fan of it. It just makes my Disney trip. It's okay. I'm going back again soon. My family goes every here and there. We went multiple times before. We are gonna get a fire flower. Oh, but we are going to lose our cats. Yet. I do not like that one bit. Uh, let's jump here see if there's anything. Else. Actually, take you guys out. Oh, there's a green star. I can go. I can actually just walk straight across here. You just gotta remember not to jump and mess yourself up. Oh, we got these things. These things are sick. Um, what is in there? Probably a fire fire. Actually, let's go here. Oh, a cherry. A cherry. Oh, yes, sir. You're gonna be able to rock out with cherries. Take him out. Hop over here. Got a cherry. No, I need you, cherry. I feel like we're gonna need you later on. Let's try to get my boys up here. E, leave me alone. Okay, so there we go. We got one green star. We are looking for the stamp and all that. There is a fire flower there, and I'm gonna have to try to dodge you. Go this way. Get in the fight. Oh my god, how do I dodge that with the other one? Okay, so there's another green star there, and there's one right here. How do we do this? Okay, so there's a ball. I guess I gotta slap it like this. There we go. And just let this thing roll. Perfect. Yeah, let's go. I wonder if we need this uh, double, uh, this uh, double cherry here. Okay, uh, let's get up on this ledge because I feel like we're gonna die here. But I feel like maybe we need that, uh, this what's called right here. I'm gonna let this thing go through. There might be another cherry in here from where we're out. Yes, there is. Right, run! Run! E! Alright, cool. We got all these guys. Right, I'm gonna go here. Gotta remember to jump back and forth. Give me this, give me this, give me this. No! Okay, we lost two of them. Is there anything down here? Oh my god, we're not gonna get this. We didn't get that green star. Are you kidding me? Uh, let me make sure at the end. Oh, we do need two of them. Okay. Oh, we're just gonna die. You know, we're just gonna die. So we need two cherries at the end to get the stamp. And before I actually get the stamp, did I get a checkpoint? I did. So there's a cherry there. I am going to get the green star before I get the stamp. We already went down the pipe. Yeah, okay, so we're chilling here. We have that second green star. But I am going to get the uh, green star before... Before this. Go back here. Be able to get all these now. Yeah, so we'll get the green star before we get the, uh, the stamp, considering it is a pain in the neck to... Uh, to deal with the cherry guys and this these switches are really annoying i'm gonna go over here and get my own i'm gonna go get this get my cherry power up now we just need to make it to get this thing all right we're chilling you know what i'm saying the levels are getting a little bit more trickier which i absolutely love go jump over this thing here go jump here and then come over here and there we go we only need two they should have made three to make it a little bit more challenging but i guess i guess it's world five and there's plenty of other worlds but do i bring out the tanuki tail I said we're good enough. I said we could do this with the opportunity to yeah. Long jump. Let's go. Let's go. You got to perfect the long jumps. 
Long jumps are great when you don't have any power-ups on your thing. Because usually most of, most of the top of the flag poles you can get with a long jump. So all you do is run, hold down your right trigger, and then hit that jump button while you're sliding and dipping at the same time. You do a nice little long jump. So it's just like right trigger for like half a second, hold it down, and then hit it. Which is gorgeous or B, whichever one you jump on. I jump with B because the run button is right here. The run button's right here so I can just slide my thumb and B jumping at the same time. I know some people like to run and then hop off the run and then uh and then hit A, which is kind of I don't like that at all. I really don't. The reason I don't like that is is because like again I can slide my thumb with Y and B and still be running. Like I'll still be running and like I don't have to stop running. But we are at the this is this the boss fight? This is just another level. It's another level. Oh, I love this level. Yo, this level's so sick. What is it called again? It's called Searchlight Sneak. I remember this one. These lights, when you're on them, look at it. Yo, you get, yo they rip you up. Chill on me. Hey! No, we're gonna do this. We're gonna grab ourselves a new kill. Chill on me, man. We got this dude right here. I don't, I kind of want to save him. Oh, another two kill. Hey! That was just smoked him. <laughs> this level is so sick. I know there's one part where you get a bunch of lights. I like hit you and you bounce. Um, is there something over here? I know I can carry these things. Chill on me. Chill on me. Are we gonna need this? Hey, yo, chill on me. No, do I need that? I think I need that for something. I'm not gonna destroy those guys just yet. Uh, can I just do this? Keep around that. Okay, so there is a green star there, which I really want. Can I get stopped by the search? Come here. Do you have it? No. You must have it. Let's float around you. Hey. Chill on me. Do not hit my boy. Oh, I can stand behind him and use my blocker. Oh no. Hey! <laughs> Chill on me. I want my Tanuki tail. I missed it. No, I got it. Run! <laughs> this level's nuts. So that was the first one. What do I got over here? Extra tail. Yo, chill on me! Okay, it's just coins. And, of course, it's just coins. Okay, I need a power right now. Uh, I think we're thriving. We're doing just fine. Yo, this level's nutty. Um, got a bunch of random coins. But I still want my other stuff. Grab ourselves a checkpoint, and we're gonna keep moving along here. Alright, there's the stamp. I'm just gonna, gonna run. Oh, I cannot run over there. Get up here. Alright, beautiful. Yo, can you guys, like, chill on me? Why? Why? Give me this sneaky tail. Slap up on you. There's an extra tail. Give me an extra tail. No extra tail. I feel like there's one maybe on top of this. No, there's not. Oh my lord. <laughs> like I said, yeah, this level's pretty tough. I love it. Oh! Chill on me. Alright, so behind this wall is where it's at. There's a bomb there. I am gonna have, actually, there's a, there's not a bomb. There's a wall. Come out of here. There's a wall that can be blown up here. Yeah, yeah, this should be second green star. Let's go. Head in here. Oh my lord. Chill on me. Get up there. Okay, cool. So you actually have to make it up there before the uh, before that uh, the bombs blow up, all that stuff. I think we're gonna need that. Give me another two tail. And I'll start carrying this because I, I think we're gonna need this for like third and final green star. Um, I'm just gonna take this one. One word. I should grab these timers. I ain't gonna lie. More time to marry. Just chill. No, I need that. Like, come on. This way, buddy. This way. And what is this thing called? Like a bounce pad enemy? And so there is a, we don't even need that. Actually, can I get on top of it? We are going to need a bunch of these guys, so we're just gonna storm this thing. Me? E. Come at me. Yes. Break more. Thank you. <laughs> there we go. Get all the, the green stars and the stamps. Now we're thriving. Here. Um, let's keep moving. Gotta keep making our way up here. Yo, this level is so much fun. This is a good level. E, get up there. We're at the end of it, though. Did I get everything? Yeah, I did. We rolling strong. We rolling real strong. Now all we have left is uh the boss fight. Unless I don't get top of five pole. But, yo, I got Tanuki Tail. Top of the five poles and cake. Tanuki Tails and Katsu's cakewalks. Or cakewalks with the uh, top of the five poles. But there we go. We're, we've been recording for about 15 minutes now. We still have the final boss fight for this world. And we have 5B. But I think 5B is coming after the world. Unless I gotta look. I'll look around and see if it's like floating around. Well, let's see. Let's see. That is lovely. No, no, no. Because we did not unlock like an extra pipe to lead us to 5B. Yes, sir. Final world. Oh, it doesn't take in, uh, a certain amount of green stuff. I think we're over that. 
think 5B is after this world. Uh, let's check the map, make sure we did everything so far. Yeah, all we have is a uh, castle on 5B. 5B is just one green zone. So I think it's like a, a boss fight at the end. There is nothing lurking around here that can lead us to another level. Bro, I love this place. All right, yo, I'm going to rank it right now. I'm going to rank it. This one's taking top cake. It's going to go this one, then, what did I say? World 3? What was World 3 again? I want to actually fast travel to World 3 just to see what it was. Oh, it was ice, yeah. It goes World 5, World 3, World 1, World 4, then World 2. That is my rankings for right now. I think the next world, because I believe it's a cloud world, I believe that one has a shot at taking number one. It does. This one was cool. I thought it had some cool levels. I think if it was a little bit more beachy, it would have definitely like been secure in top spot for rest. Playthrough, but I think this one might jump to like four. But they got some good worlds coming up. Some really good worlds. Some really good worlds. Hopefully I can rem remember the list. Because it, it eventually will get up to like 14 worlds, which I had to remember. Oh, but yo, I love this boss fight. The boss fight is legit this thing. It's like a spike guy, isn't it? It's like a spike square. It's actually pretty funny. We're going to keep moving along here. Yeet. Give me all them coins. Give me all them coins. Oh, we capped on today. We capped on this boss fight. Yeah, I can actually jump through those. But there's actually people who do like playthroughs or like speed runs on on like Mario games, but if they get a coin, they have to restart from the beginning. Which I think is absurd. They tried doing that in Super Mario Brothers 2 for the DS, considering that game is like revolved around coins. But you guys know what I'm saying? Like it's just coins all around. I gotta get all these coins. Give me this. Come here. Come here. And last two, is this for lucky number one? I think it is. Yep. Like number one on us. Okay, let's look over here. I do not want to miss anything. We got the first one. We keep heading this way. And is there anything back here? Is there anything back here? There's not. There is not. But yo, if you guys haven't checked out my uh, most recent upload for Pokemon Sword and Shield Online Battles, go check that one out. We used this whole Galio team. It actually, was used to actually get ranked number one in the world. And it is phenomenal. It is ridiculously strong. So if you guys are trying to push a ladder, go for it. Go for it with that team. It is so strong. Very easy to use. The team synergy is so good as well. It's just phenomenal. We get another cat belt. Do I want the cat belt now? I kind of think I'd rather have a team to kill on this team. Um, can I get up? Oh, there's a green star! I wonder if that green star would have came back around. I went I went for it considering I was like, yo, I really want this. I only went for it because of the what's it called? Because I thought it was gonna disappear. I thought we were on a timer. But I can actually get another cat suit here. We need another cat suit. Okay, so we got that one. Oh, where is that green star at? These charging chucks. Come out of the third one, right? There it is. Come here. Hey, no! No! I missed it again. Charge chuck. Get hit by a spike shot. Pop. Okay, it comes back around, so I didn't have to do that. Anything up here? That's my question. Oh, there is. Oh, the stamp! Yo, Gene, you're a genius. The stamps on I think I checked. There we go. Grab that stamp and get rolling around this way. Let me fix my microphone for you guys so you guys can hear my lovely little voice. <laughs> Are we in here now? I'm going to wait for this thing to drop and then bounce through it. There we go. Yo, I like this little stuff. Are uh, we over here? We got one more green star left and it's up there. Let me, let me climb. Let me climb. I hear a green star. It's over here. Oh my lord, how am I figuring this stuff out? I just figured out. I was like, yo, they're giving us cat suits. We gotta climb. We have to climb. We still have 200 seconds left to actually defeat this boss fight. I'm gonna get moving along with it. And here we go. Let's get it. We still have 5B. But I gotta figure out where that is. Again, I think it's after the world, like the last one. But yeah, this is the exact dude I'm talking about. Look at him. He slides away. He like grips up. And now he's mad. God, I love the little boss fights he do. And so it shows. Okay, I can actually hit him. E! Uh, can you fall this way? Can you just stand up this way? Yeah, there you go. Now fall towards me. There you go. Now I can jump on you. Wow. There's one shot. Two more to go. Like I said, in the next Mario game, in Odyssey, they should definitely add health bars. 100% they should add health bars instead of the three hit system. Health bars would be so much better. Make the boss fights longer. Probably make them harder as well. But I feel like that's the one thing Mario games really lack in is boss fight difficulties. Because usually the boss fights are pretty simple, pretty easy. Oh, sorry. I was actually fixing something on my on my keypad. On my keypad, I should have took the jump and finished them off. But yeah, usually boss fights are so simple like this. Like it's just three hits. It's nothing big. They should really uh, start using health bars. Like Breath of the Wild made start using health bars, which is awesome. I really did enjoy. 
made the boss fights a little bit harder. I wish the final boss fight was harder. Like, like they did the first half of the boss fight pretty cool in Breath of the Wild, where it's like you fight all the Calamity Ganons. But then, at the end, where you were facing like the giant Calamity Ganon, it wasn't that hard. You just shot the lane. Should have made a full on going crazy, getting after it. Like, that's what I'm excited for Breath of the Wild 2 and Odyssey 2. Like, it's gonna be an amazing game considering both their first ones were just like starter games. They were just trials. Now they know what to make. Now they know what everybody wants. But there we go. Defeat this world. Basically, 100% it. We just need to finish, finish up 5B. We defeat the boss here. We get ourselves, what is that? Fifth pixie? Look at this. Yeah. Yeah. We got the purple one. The purple one's dope. The purple one looks awesome. But all we have left is 5B, and then we'll be finished off this episode, and we get a sick charging Chuck little stamp. Little stampy. Damn, damn. Build me my glass pipe. Give it to me. Oh, she built it. I skipped the rope. But yeah, we can head through this pipe. I believe there should be a boss right here. Uh, we got world one, two, three, and then this one should be Cloud World, I think. I think it's Cloud World next. It's gonna be amazing. <gasps> It is Cloud World, but where's 5B? It is Cloud World. I just want to go see. We might be able to do this one in one episode. Oh my lord. Yeah, yeah. One, two, three, four. There's four and then uh, five. Oh, this one might be a little bit longer. Let's actually check it out. Oh, ooh. This one might be a two. This, this might be a two. This is probably going to be a two episode one. This is long. This is longer than the other one. Looks like we have seven, we have eight worlds, including the boss fight, A, B, and C, and we have a mystery house. No toad house. Maybe we can speed through it and get grinding with it. But I actually want to head through this pipe. I'm looking for 5B. What's up here? That looks dope. But no, I'm not, I'm, I'm not allowed to do any levels here. Yo, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold up. Please still be there. Yo, there's a hidden Luigi. There is a hidden Luigi. Let me know if you guys see it. I'm about to point it out. If you look at the path... I don't know how I found this. I just saw it out the corner of my eye. If you look at the path, like the little cloud path that uh, Mario walks on where the level path is, look where the gap is between the two clouds where the paths are about to meet. There's a Luigi just chilling in the middle. That's pretty, that's pretty chill. But okay, we're going to head back to uh, World 5. We still got a little bit of time left, and I still got to find 5B. Where do I find 5B? That's my question. Over here. A. Here it is. Okay, cool. Let's hop down here. <laughs> Let's hop down here. And where's the sleeping thing? Ooh. Ooh. Another pipe. Point and another pipe. Cut through this pipe. We see back to world one. Hey! Oh, yo. I never went in here. I never went here. I want to go in here. I think it's just like coins and stuff. Or no, it's another toad house, which I do. I'm going to save that. I'm going to save that. So that's a hidden toad house. I do not need any items, so I'm going to save that. I'll save that for like, say I need a cat suit. I can always remember to come back there and use that one. Bam, bam, bam. So that's a little shortcut there. And does this lead me to 5B? Where's 5B at? I've been looking for it. Yeah, it does. Oh, it's a golden train. Right? This is 5B, right? It's gotta be 5B. <laughs> is this 5B? Or is this just gold train? Hey, yo, gold train in it? This is five train. Give me a sec. Oh my lord, yo. Let's just collect some coins here. Give me all these coins. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is there a green star at the end of this? I think it's just all coins. Oh, yeah, you can do this. Yes, sir. Give me all them coins. <laughs> we found a gold train. That's so sick. I don't think we found 5B. I think we just found five gold trains. So we still gotta find 5B. It's time to find it. Yo, this is so sick. Give me all these coins. Oh my lord. Hidden train for the coins. Give me all them. How many coins did we collect? There are so many here. Cat and Toad showing down here. What does Cat and Toad give us? <laughs> this is so sick. Unlimited coins. Okay, Cat and Toad, I'll come down to you. You have, a, you have something for me, or are you just saying something? Okay, right, so we're just gonna hit that. Oh, more coins are gonna pop out. Thank you. This Cat and Toad doesn't do anything, he's just chilling there. There's like gold dust coming out from there. What's in here? No, oh, get up here. I wonder if we can get inside this pipe. That would be awesome. Anything in the front? No, we're gonna head down here and back to this gold pipe. I wonder where this takes me to. Slots, yo! Let's go! <laughs> Come on, can we get back to back perfection on slots? I hit this middle. 
Tanuki tail. We're rocking. Uh, we, if we're rocking Tanuki tail, we gotta bring out the Tanuki tail. Come on, baby. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. All right, Tanuki tail, coming right up. Make up for everything. Let's go. Okay, we'll take one. At least we didn't just completely fail that one. I'll take my catchy back. <laughs> but dude, if we would have failed that, so slots is what ends it, but where's 5B? I'm curious. There's something over here. There is. Where does this take me to? Back to world three. This is like a big shortcut. Where is my actually I can fast travel. Fast travel. I guess we're gonna look for more of those little things that open up. Give us a pipe. There is 5B. I'm not. I'm not getting off till we find 5B. It's gotta be right here. It's gotta be right here. Here it is. Let's go. Okay, so we gotta fight Hammer Bro again. 5B. Another Hammer Bro hideout, man. Or Fire Bro hideout. This is the second one. I think we did the last one in the last one. 100 seconds should be light work. Let me bring out my Tanuki tail. Oh, this one's sick. And I can do this. No, why am I sliding? Get him out of here. Look at that. <laughs> there we go. Is that it? Or is there another hammer, bro? Nope. Just do that. And get ourselves that green star and completely 100% this world, yo. This world was awesome. I had a lot of fun with it. And the cool part was getting that gold train. I'm a big fan of that gold train. That was actually sick. Gold train knows where it's at. But what I'm really gonna like is this next world. Like the cloud, the cloud world looks phenomenal. World six. I believe there's a total of 13 worlds, including the three special worlds and the crown. World. I believe it goes this one, then seven, eight, and then we have circus, then four, and plus something else. I believe there's like 12 to 13. I think there's 13. I'm not too sure. But guys, that is gonna be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As in the next episode. We are going to be tackling on World 6, trying to do all these levels in one go, and trying to 100% them with all the green stars and stamps. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.